Do you guys know what day it is? It's Motivational Thursday. And on Motivational Thursday, it means it's time to get your butt up off the couch and go make some freaking money. Tell them, Savannah. What's up, guys? Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh huh. That would make you laugh. Savannah's over here gambling once again. Gee, Louise, don't you know those things are a waste of money? Yeah, I think no, you don't. <laughs> and how long's it been sitting there? About six years. She won two dollars and it's been sitting in her car. Uh, get that big money. You need to start spending more money so you can win more money. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding, Savannah. I'm kidding. All right, guys. Sean here. Savannah here with Spencer's Lawn Care. We're getting this day rocking and rolling. I got my coffee down here. Savannah's got her a vitamin water. And we're ready to rock and roll. Let's go. Team on my back. I do it all for the family. Everyone that they can rap. Nobody ever gonna challenge me. Starting my week on a Sunday. And then they can make it a one day. I just been ready to take off. Waiting my turn on the wrong way. Never be turning around. Never be turning around. Ayy. Never be slowing it down. Never be slowing it down. Ayy. I keep my foot on the gas. I keep my foot on the gas. Ayy. I know I'm never gonna crash. I know I'm never gonna crash. Ayy. Never be turning around. Never be turning around. This week's what did we find in the yard? A house phone. The battery's still attached to it. And it's still got power. Somebody definitely lost this off the top of their car. Everyone making excuses. I've been busy making music. They just want to see me fall off. Know that I'm never going to lose it. Got addicted to the chase now. People saying that I change now. Know that I'm never going to stand still. I'm treating the game like a race now. They really been carefully watching me. They treated me like I was calories. But really they can't get enough of me. They treated me like I'm a salary. They're bringing me up in discussion. They wonder what.
my victories all of a sudden and y'all gonna be mad at me damn i don't have time for concern i just go live and i learn trust me i wait Living my dream in return, this is a given concern People been listening over the world, I've been making that money while I be asleep I never ran the money, but now all the money been too busy running Right, guys it's got the driveway knocked back savannah's almost done over there all she's got left is just a few more stripes here in the front yard looking good looking good just got to get it blowed off and we'll freaking be out of here all right guys so i want to point out something i know i see you guys comment all the time and say sean why don't you trim the cracks in the driveways or walkways whatever and we do to an extent but you have to understand guys we're here to mow the lawn trim the lawn, edge the lawn. The cracks are something we will hit if they're just something that we can do real quick while we're trimming and edging the walkways, driveways. But a lot of the times we don't do it if it's very time consuming. And I'll say it like that, let me show you here. Okay, you guys have seen me edge that there. I still gotta finish everything else. But I edge it and then I just knocked a little bit of the crack off right there close to where we work. Okay. Now, am I supposed to come in and hit all these cracks every single week? The homeowners don't complain about it. So obviously, they're not too worried about it. Uh, you know, this lawn here takes us roughly 30 minutes. I'm not going to spend an extra half an hour trimming out the driveway. You know what I'm saying? We'll edge it. We'll trim it, but we're not gonna hit the cracks. Everyone think they can rap. Nobody ever gonna challenge me. Starting my week on a Sunday. They think they can make it in one day. I just been ready to take off. Waiting my turn on the runway. Never be turning around. Never be turning around. Hey, never be slowing it down. Never be slow. Look at them stripes, baby. Look at them stripes. Savannah did a phenomenal job. You did a great job on them stripes. Thanks. Are you proud of yourself? I'm pretty proud of myself. Back to her stripes. She should be proud of them stripes. There's a lot of guys that can't stripe for nothing. I mean, can't stripe for nothing. I don't know what it is. I understand if you're down south, south, like desert south, Texas south, where it's extremely hot. I understand the grasses are different. Florida grasses are different. And a lot of those just don't stripe up. But, I mean, I see a lot of these guys that are just mowing and going. That's all they're doing. I mean, I get it. I mean, if they're not, if the people don't care, you know, mow it and go. Whatever. But up here, the Midwest, where we're at, the stripes sell. Everybody wants the stripes. I know they're not everybody's cup of tea. I get, I've had clients before to tell me, you know, I don't care about the stripes. But, I'll tell you what. I don't know if I've ever gotten a client off a yard that I didn't stripe up. Just saying. And as always, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. I'll talk to you later.